I'm running into the weirdest shit. Rest well. Alright, so we're gonna see what this does. One to bone armor. Poison length reduced by 25%. Two to seven poison damage added. It is better than this. So, I don't even need that. That's shitty. That's the shittiest thing I've ever seen. What's an armor point? Ah, don't need it. So now, so we got some pretty good stuff from that. So, look at our quest log. Return to Kasha for a reward. Ooh, what's that? Head? Oh wait, she's left me and I forgot. Ha! Yeah. Hey, I get to watch her do it with Taurasi or something. That'd be pretty cool. I can hardly believe that you've defeated Bloodraven. Though she was once my closest friend, I pray that her tortured spirit remains banished forever. You have earned my respect, stranger, and the allegiance of the Rose. I have placed several of my best warriors at your disposal. All right, so now we have a dyke buddy, which I'm gonna go back to higher because I'm all about the um, cold arrow archer because cold is better than fire because cold makes him slower and it's it's, it's better to have by your side. So we're gonna go ahead and get that. So now we're level five. We have a level two cold archer person. We have skeleton. And that's it so far. I mean, I'm kind of getting too far into this already. I mean, I'm kind of weak still. I mean, usually it's a level six by now, but. Keep putting it off. Whoa, my guy died there. I wasn't expecting to die so fast. Alright, so did they drop anything good? See what that does. <laughs> Wilted armor, shit. Only knife. Must sell for quite a bit, actually. But the only reason to come in here, they're, they're not required or anything, but you can get some good treasures. I, mean, I, might, I might cut out some of the caves and stuff because I'm gonna need to level up here soon. I'm kind of below level right now. I don't know how this let's play is gonna go. I might end up starting over with a different character because it is really hard with this guy. With this guy so the necromancer is definitely the hardest to be. Ooh, eight gold, nice. It's a treasure chest! <laughs> yes. Leather glove will take the don't want the other stuff, but this can't possibly sell for that much. We're gonna go ahead and heal again. And then put these in our belt. Because our belt can hold, our, our sash can hold eight potions at a time. Tell me how that's physically possible. So now we're gonna go down here. We're gonna wake up some masturbating zombies, if there are any. Wow, done. Barrels. Oh, strangling gas. Health mine. Take the barrels. Open the graves. Eagle orb. What's that? One the frost nova. Shitty. Nothing here. But wait, there's another room. Oops. Ew. Oh, there we go. Monsters. Very much in here. Ooh, leather, gold leather gloves. What is with the good items that we get? I don't get it. 17 attack rain, 20% enhanced defense, one strength, one defense, 35% lightning resist. Um, I think I'd rather actually have this, so I'm gonna go ahead and put that on. So now we're done with this area, so now we're gonna go to the other side of the graveyard, which has 
a unique boss named Bonebreaker, I think. Yeah, because he's he wasn't in here, and he's like a red skeleton. He's he's worth fighting for experience. Oh shit! Yeah, you suck. I'm taking this shit. I'm terrible at this. I, I don't know if I can do it. If I can complete this, let's go. So now we're just gonna explore another blood pit, dead bodies, and demons, and arrows. Skeletons. Oh look, I think that's him. No, that's not. It's a different boss. That's weird. Oh, shit, they're about to kill my skeleton, man. He has the cold over us, so it makes everybody cold that's around them, but that was quick. It's actually a paladin skill, so it's actually pretty useful. I need a key. And I don't have a key still. What is with that? I have not found one key yet in this adventure. Nothing. 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 Yeah, nothing. <laughs> nothing. Nothing, 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 nothing good. Damaged buckler. Nothing, nothing. Nothing. God. This is terrible, man. There's nothing in this place. Except gold gloves. If I found that here, I think I found it on the other side. Buckler. Nothing. 15 gold. Oh, oh, look. Now this is where Bone Breaker is. Where is he? Yes. He's coming through. It's all the way in the back there. He should be red. Yeah, see, there he is. Bone breaker, extra strong. Not really, I just killed him in one hit with my dildo. You didn't drop anything? What? Oh, holy shit. Man, I must be just lucky to get all this stuff. I don't usually get this much good items in this game. Especially at this point. So now we got gold. Gold, 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 gold. Gold, gold. A sash. Great. Okay, so that's all we... Oh wait, there's another room over here. There might be another boss. If I was a paladin, I'd be loving this game right now, because I found a lot of good stuff. And it's still a lot. That is not Zelda like. There's never locked a chest, they're all unlocked. This game is not smart enough to lock the chest in the temple. Large charm, huh? Well, I guess. I guess I could tell back to town and get a key, but it's probably not going to be important or anything, so... Ah, no, nah, I don't care. And it, it's... Oh, gosh, there's probably, like, a super unique item in there, which is really good. Those are... Whenever it's, like, a golden, dark, yellow, dark, golden color, that means the item is really rare, and you will not find those often in the game. They even have a different look to them compared to other items. They're really cool. Alright, let's let the stamina recharge real quick because it's taking too long. Alright, back to the lab again. Alright, so we're just going to continue our quest for Diablo. Oh, a chest. That's not bad. Alright, so now we're going to go... We need to go back to town and talk to that car, I think. For our next quest. So we're gonna go ahead and do that after I explore over here real quick. There might be something. Oh, alright, so back to town. 
and we're gonna identify these items and find out how much they're worth, what I want to keep, and what do I want to get rid of. It is clear that we are facing an evil difficult to comprehend, let alone combat. There is only one Haradrim sage, schooled in the most arcane history and lore, who could advise us. His name is Deckard Cain. You must go to Tristram and find him, my friend. I pray that he still lives. Alright, Deckard Cain is a character from Diablo 1, the most important character in the game. Good day. Tristram is a town that takes place in Diablo 1, so... So you have to go back to Tristram through a teleport gate to try to find him. Bring him back safely, she says. We'll bring him back safely, alright. Ain't <laughs> the life. 14. Shitty. Cold resist 7. Shit. Don't need it. Don't use swords. Don't use that. Don't use swords. One to dexterity. Shitty, shitty. Throwing knives. Crap. Cap of balance. 10% faster hit recovery. Okay. Shit, shit. And I don't need that. And I'll go ahead by two cannon potions. Alright, so we're good there. Quest log. Go through the underground pass into the dark woods, search for the tree of Inethus, and recover the scroll. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and do that. I don't know why I did this, why I went back to Cold Plains, but I did, so we're just gonna walk through. And plus, we just found a boss! He like, heals himself. No. Oh shit, he had mana burn, okay. Mana burn, yeah. That explains it. So, we gotta go ahead and drink one of the potions, recover our mana. Yeah, follow the path. The Diablo, like, I mean, come on, what? Did they build this path to show where I want to go? I mean, come on, why would they build the path? Straight to where Diablo and Where Diablo could be, anyway. Kill this guy, he's fire enchanted, they explode after you kill him. No big deal. That's a little bit damage. And we just got a level up! Yay! Level 6! Yay! Oh my god! Level 6! Yay! Level 6! Yay! Yeah, I'll stop that. That is really interesting. If any of you have seen Frank Dixon, you'll know what I'm what I'm doing. But, okay, new skill. Clay Golem. Bam! Best skill yet. These stats? We're gonna get. We're gonna get strength. Why not? So we're gonna get our golem out. He just comes out of nowhere. It requires no bodies to make it, so I can just keep summoning and summoning and summoning until we kill a certain guy. It's no problem. Okay, don't need that. So we're gonna go straight down in this little path, corridor, or whatever you want to call it. We're gonna fight some skeletons. Or one skeleton. Alright, here we should be facing tougher enemies, but not much tougher, so it shouldn't be too bad. Recover here. I don't get how the skeletons just bust in a thousand pieces. That doesn't even make sense. I mean, come on. The skeleton just breaks from a wand hitting them in the fucking face. Man, come on. Oh well, underground passage already. Fuck, dude. We're fighting everything. And we found this. What the hell, man? This is the easiest world I've ever seen. 
Watch, I'm staying there. 